I don't know, man. I've been rambling on. I've had a little monster energy. So, if y'all ever wonder what is a really cheap meal that you can get delivered to you in Seoul, South Korea, this video might be for you because I've been perusing my delivery apps and I found what I think may be one of the cheapest, if not the cheapest, decent looking full meal that I've ever seen here in Seoul. This cost me $7 total, including the, the delivery fee and everything. There is no tipping here. I've mentioned a lot that a lot before, so that's not gonna add in the, into the price. But most places here will have not only a delivery fee, but they'll also have a minimum order. So a lot of places will start at like $10 or up, $15 minimum orders. And they'll also have delivery fees, which are probably two, three, four bucks. So I was looking for places that had really cheap delivery fees and really low minimum amounts. And this is what I landed on. Let's take a look at what we got here. Looking beast. So this is soy sauce, garlic, chicken, mayo over rice. And this itself cost about $5, but the, uh, the delivery fee at this place was $2. Can't really skate around that. It also came with a couple little side dishes here. I'm gonna put it on this plate and hopefully you can see it a little bit better. It's not gonna, you're gonna lose the presentation, but it is what it is. A lot of times with this kind of thing, you'll mix it up anyway. So you have the rice on the bottom. You have a bunch of like soy sauce, mayo. You got the fried kind of chicken right here. Some of these green like little seaweed flakes, salted. And this is just an amalgamation and it's a pretty hefty amount, it's substantial. You know, this could definitely be a full meal for somebody. This, to me, uh, it's got the, the carbs and it's got the proteins a little bit, you know what I'm saying? So uh, this is what I was looking for when I was looking for a full meal. Doesn't look very appetizing right now. It did before, but uh, we're gonna test it out and see how it eats. I'm hoping it's tasty. I've had stuff like this before, never from this restaurant. So let's take a bite. I'm gonna go in for a bite of, try to get a little bit of everything on here. Hopefully it's not too sweet. Chicken, rice. Mmm. That's really good. Uh, it's warm. It's, it's like, ah, what's the word I'm looking for? It's, it's got some good textures to it. So you have that kind of like creaminess of the mayo mixing with the rice. We also get that little crispiness of the chicken bites in there. Decent like quality, I feel like. Mm. That's honestly way better than I expected. This is kind of like a um, pickled radish type of thing. The seaweed that like the dried salted like seaweed flakes in there had a little bit of uh extra umami maybe not that's maybe not that's not it but a little bit of extra flavor in there and like i said like i don't know if you can really tell how much this is but it's a full paper plate i'll do the drop test Not only is this better than I thought it would be, the amount is also way more than I thought it would be, especially the chicken. I thought, honestly, this would be about half the size. Um, these, like I said, these are already in there. I feel like this for a lot of people could be hit or miss. Just some kind of kimchi or something looking like. real decent especially for the price so seven bucks for this you're not really finding anything that includes the delivery fee and the, the place with a decent minimum order uh amount you're not really finding anything in this price range honestly Also, a lot of places will say they got free delivery, but 
it's only if you spend over a certain amount of money. Like if you spend over 20, 30 bucks, then it's free. But if you just get something really cheap or cheaper, then it's you're going to get hit with that three, four, five dollars. I think these days it seems like the average delivery fee where I am uh, is probably like, at least like three bucks. What you could do is order two of these uh, and you'd have the same two dollar delivery fee. So it'd be like 12 bucks. really decent meal right there i don't think it would satisfy me for a whole day definitely not but yeah dude like for years i, I probably lived off of 20 bucks a week for food which i feel like you can't really do that anymore especially with delivery i mean even if even if you did you know two of these every day or you know even if you did one of these every day you could still maybe scheme uh scheme it if you cooked or did something else i don't even know if you can he says i'm saying the prices are going up man i'll tell you what man I used to shovel my neighbor's driveway, old man Dale, when it snowed, and he, me and my brother would do it, and he would give us a dime each. I'm talking 10 cents. I feel like I'm really becoming that old man now. Like I see a price on someone, I'm like, damn, man, I ain't getting that. I don't know, man, I've been rambling on. I've had a little monster energy, so. I'm about to skate out of here real quick. So thank you for watching this one. Uh, hope you got something out of it, probably not, but Peace.